Better than chicken. <laughs> A little bit crunchy, the bone. Mm -hmm. You fold it in half. Nem Nergali. Nergali, Nem. Andreas. Andreas? Yeah. Yes. and welcome to Asia and this is my five favorite tours in Asia and something you need to do in 2025 so now we are in Cambodia Batabang and here you have a sugarcane machine sugarcane use it's a very sweet drink that is very popular around Southeast Asia typically in Vietnam and Cambodia and Laos and also Thailand but here we are going on a bamboo train and this everything in this uh, tour the Batabang tour cost me 15 U US dollars and that was transportation lunch uh, not beer no beer uh, you have to pay for your beer uh, but we have a very good guide also he was very funny very good at English he, I will, he will eating rats very soon in this video. Uh, I was also considering maybe I also will eat rat, but no, I did not eat rat. Uh, uh, I was no rat was not for me. They have frogs and rat they have on the side side street like uh, you can eat frogs, grilled frogs and grilled rat. But now, here we have the rat. They have a tiny and small. What is in the wild? What day is it made as he found the rats, like uh, two, three hundred rats. But now they saw uh, <laughs> the rat had the brain. <laughs> Eat everything. There's a liver, tail. Mmm, better than chicken. <laughs> A little bit crunchy, the bone. Mm -hmm. As you, you want, I give you one, the head. Mm, the head. You eat the head? Yeah, the brain. Is there no bones in that? Mm. A little. Mm, break the arm for you. Liver, liver. Yeah. Does did that look good, <laughs> rat? But now we are at the killing field in the. In uh, in Batabang, also the Killing Cave. It's uh, it's a very s sad place actually. It was like the the genocide in the in the late seventies from uh, a very yeah very bad person in uh, in Cambodia. He killed. I don't know. I remember how many he killed, but they killed. Him. Yeah, it's. It's almost like the Holocaust in so Germany the during the Second World War too. You look, look like too. Family, you know, uh, yeah. Here you have the bones of uh, people that yes, was killed during his... Uh, yeah, I, I have no words here. It's, it's a very sad place, but also very interesting. Uh, they have a different places around Cambodia this was Batabang and you can also go to the capital the capital have a bigger museum and that stuff 
uh, but yeah, I did not, I, I did not go to the capital. I was, I was a little bit after this, uh, this tour. I was like a little bit fed up about how everything, what people can do to each other. Uh, th this was very sad and very crazy, but something you need to see in the, your lifetime. But here you have the killing fields, and uh, yeah. But I would recommend you to go on this tour. It was very, it was a very good tour. And now we are at the bat caves. You see up here, you see the streams. It's all it's bats. They are coming out at in the evening. Uh, it's like thousands, millions of bats coming out from the, the bat cave. It was a uh, very, very cool thing to see. The first Achilles field and the bat, bat, bat cave. But now I'm in Vietnam, in Saigon, Ho Chi Minh City, and I am on a food tour. And it cost me thirty dollars, and then everything was included: transportation, guides, cooking lessons, you name it. And I was for like three or four hours, and we was I was driving around. Uh, not I was not. I was sitting on the back of uh, a, a motorbike, and uh, the guide. We was like five people, five or six people, and uh, you see here. Yeah, the food is. The Vietnamese f uh, kitchen. <laughs> yeah, you see here. Oh. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> balut, balut. I, I did not eat balut. I have to close my eyes. Yeah. It's, it's for good luck. <laughs> Mm, close your eyes. Yummy, yummy. Don't imagine in your mind that you are eating a duck. Many people say that. Ten out of ten. Yeah, ten out of ten. It was. <laughs> yeah, but now I'm. We are still here at this tour. And my favorite tour, my favorite food in uh, in Vietnam is uh, the sugar cane use here again. Uh, it's uh, spring rolls, fresh spring rolls. I would say well, it's my favorite uh, food in Vietnam. I really like that one. Uh. And now I am in Kazakhstan. And I took a tour around Kazakhstan. Oh. One of my favorite countries actually in Asia is Kazakhstan. Friendly people, good places to see, good nature. Now I'm in Sharin Canyon and some lakes around uh, a city called Almaty. Not around Almaty, but... Uh, <laughs> Thank you, thank you. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Thank you. 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 Ah, 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 <laughs> yeah, that was uh, lunch, and that was included in the uh, in the tour, and uh, yeah, but it was a very good day. Uh, it was me and one British guy from we, we met up in the hostel, and we did the tour together with uh, was it three. 
uh, yeah, three people from US and one uh, and one person from Kazakhstan and also two, two Russians also. It was a uh, very good day, very fun day. It was a little bit long. It took, I think, we started at five in the morning and we come back in the evening around nine or ten. And there was horseback riding and everything. And because for everything, the horseback riding was not included in the first prize, so you have to pay extra. And it cost 70 US dollars for everything. So it was, uh, it was very cool. Everything that's I mean, that snacks, extra activities, yeah. The lunch was included, but if you wanted to have something extra, you have to pay more. So this day cost me 70 US dollars. 60, yeah, around 60 US dollars for, for the tour with lunch. And then you have to pay extra for some activities like horseback riding. But now we are in Vietnam again, in Sapa. And I mean, uh, in uh, Sapa local communities, and I in in a whole I did a homestay tour here with the lady here. I stay with her family, and then then I did the the trek with her, and it was very very interesting. Uh, it was uh, was very cool to stay in a local place. Now in uh, we are going up to her place here. In the dark, and here is my room. Yay! It cost me thirty-five dollars for everything. It was a, uh, it was dinner, lunch, and breakfast, and a guided tour. And then you can sit down and um, talk to her family. No one does not really speak English. She did speak English very good. She was. Uh, it's something you need to go go to do if you are in Sapa and in in Asia. This is also one of my favorite experiences in Asia. So if you are in Sapa, you need to go and visit the local family, the local communities and do a homestay. Uh, maybe with this lady. If you make a comment down below, I will um, send you her WhatsApp number. And then you can book, book her to uh, her tours as well. She was very, very, very good. Very good, actually. I really highly recommend her. And uh, yeah, Sapa, 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 Sapa. Now we are soon leaving Sapa. Bye bye. And I mean Vietnam again. Hang and Cave. And this is my favorite experience for Asia. I think I. It costs 300 US dollars, so it's quite pricey. But I really recommend to do, do this. It's like the, the biggest cave system in the world they have in Vietnam. And I took that tour here. It cost me 300 US dollars, as I said. And this is for two days, one night. And the guys is amazing. They are funny, they speak very good English. And we have very good activities during the night. Uh, and free tea, free tea, free green tea for everyone. And I love tea. I really love tea. But yeah, this is something you really need to do when you're in with. <laughs> So that bucket was washed up there in the 2020 everybody. The flood was able to reach all the way to that mass to bring the bucket up there. Wow. Yeah. And it's got like stuck in there. Yeah, stuck in there ever since.
Yeah, you see here, the cave is huge, and you see this tent. Yeah, you you really need to go to Hang Yang Cave in Vietnam. If if you're in Asia and Vietnam, pay the extra money and go to Hang Yang Cave. Uh, and this is only one company that you that you can can that you can go to the Hang Yang Cave with, and this Oxakalix or something. And yeah, but wow, I I have no words. It is is, uh, and all of course it was the guys was very important, and, and also I have a very good group. It was a group of ten people, no more. They were no no people from Vietnam. It was uh, two Greeks, and then it was five or six Americans, one Dutch guy. And some English girls, and one French woman, a girl, and a f yeah, yeah. So this is was people from everywhere. It was a very good, good, good tour. And this is my f top five tours that you need to do in two thousand and twenty-five in Asia. Don't do not miss this. It's a really good experience. All of these tours. It's time for some Coca-Cola and water and beer was included in, <laughs> in the tour. So everything was included in this tour, like the food, the, the guides and also the porters that carried everything to the cave. Uh, but this, like the, the view is breath, breathtaking. So this was my five, five top, five top tours that you need to do in 2025 and in the next one we are in uh, Sri Lanka see you bye